Hi, my name is Sandra. In this video, I'm going to show you how to manually provision a Polycom VBX 400 and 410 on the Devoice UC platform. Go to Menu by pressing the Home button. Select Settings by using the arrow keys from your navigation tool. Press the button in the middle of your navigation tool to open the Settings menu. Select Advanced by using your up and down arrow keys from the navigation tool. Press the button in the middle of your navigation tool to open the advanced menu. Enter the password 456 by using the dial pad. Press the button in the middle of your navigation tool to submit your password and access the advanced menu. Select administration settings by using the up and down arrow keys. Press the button in the middle to open the administration settings. Select network configuration by using the up and down arrow keys Press the button in the middle to open Network Configuration. Select Provisioning Server by using the up and down arrow keys. Press the button in the middle to open the Provisioning Server. Select DHCP Menu by using the up and down arrow keys. Press the button in the middle to open the DHCP Menu. Select Boot Server by using the up and down arrow keys. Press the button in the middle to edit the boot server. Go to Static by using the up and down arrow keys. Press the button in the middle to select the option Static. You will be taken to the previous menu and the boot server should now show Static. Press the button Back. Select Server Type by using the up and down arrow keys. Press the button in the middle to edit the server type. Go to HTTP by using the up and down arrow keys. Press the button in the middle to select the option HTTP. You will be taken to the previous menu and the server type should now show HTTP. Next, select server address by using the up and down arrow keys. Press the button in the middle to edit the server address. Enter cfg.voice.dynmx.net forward slash cfg by using the dial pad. You can find the letters needed above the numbers. Press the button in the middle of your navigation tool to submit the server address. Continue pressing back until you arrive at a screen where you can save your configurations. Go to Save Config and press the button in the middle to select this option and you have manually provisioned the phone and it will auto reboot. Please contact Dynamic Support or your account manager for dedicated training.